Hello everyone, Linda Israel here with day 19 of the January Creative Prompts. Again, I hope you're enjoying these prompts. Do check below in the description box by clicking more to show all that information about the Friendly Junk Journal People Facebook group where you can join the event and share your pictures of your creative prompts that you answered whenever you were doing this and ask questions as well be inspired by those that are sharing within the event. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do so. I do go live on Mondays at 3.45 p.m. Central Standard Time and again on Thursdays at 12.30 p.m. Central Standard Time. When I'm on vacation, I will have a premiere video up there and that's where I'm going to be on our next uh, day, which is the 20th. So I will be gone, but I will have a video for you and I hope you enjoy it. All right, so for today, we're supposed to use a stencil to create your journal page today. Write about whatever made you smile today. My journal page today is a basically the index to where cities are in a map atlas. And I, I it's okay, but I want to be able to put something over that. And I just happened to find this book page out of a dictionary that the majority of it is blank. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to trim this to fit on top of this page that's in my journal. So I'm just going to kind of crease it where I want it to be and then I'm just going to trim this down. All right so I trimmed the piece of paper down just a little bit. That should fit right onto my book page. I'm just going to make sure I may need to trim it a little bit more. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to trim it just a tad more because it's not quite in the center. So I'm just going to trim a little bit more off. Okay, so now that will fit on my page. I'm going to move my journal out of the way so that we can apply stenciling to this piece. I'm just grabbing a random piece of paper that I have on my desk and I'm going to lay on here my stencil. The stencil is from the January Artistic Stencil Club. If you haven't seen my stencils, I hand draw all of my stencils and then I bring them into a software to create them as a cut file. And then my husband, he will use our laser to cut the stencils for me. So I'm just kind of lining this up where I think I want the patterns to come together. And I've got some Fire Brick Distress Ink by Tim Holtz, and I've got a little oval blending brush. So I'm just gonna grab some color and try to center this up. I'm trying to decide where I want it, but I think right about there. I'm gonna put just a tad of washi tape down to kind of hold it in place for a moment. All right, so I've just got a little bit of washi tape to help hold this, loading up my brush, and basically I'm gonna go around that outside edge, adding a little bit of color. I'm going ahead and coming towards the center, but I'm being really light about it. I just want a little bit of a pattern. I don't want it to be super dark in the middle. All right, I think I like that. I'm gonna remove the stencil. Oh yeah, I think that looks really good, doesn't it? All right, so next I want to do some rubber stamping on here. So I'm gonna grab the textured edges and we're gonna stamp around this with Jet Black Archival Ink. I don't like the way that looks. I've got my little box here that I use whenever I'm spraying things. And I've got the, where did it go? I just had it. Oh, there it is. I have the Walnut Gold Tattered Angels. It's a real pale, almost like a tea dye, but has a gold shimmer to it. So I'm going to spritz this. And that'll add just a little bit of shimmer to my page. I'm going to dry this with my heat tool, and then I'll be right back. All right, so that's dry. I like the way this is turning to out. All right, so now I'm going to do is I'm going to adhere this to my journal page. So I'm just kind of lining this up here to see where I'm going to put it. All right, I'm going to put a little bit of glue on the back side of this and glue it down. All right, so there is my foundation. I've got a little label that's part of the Radiant Red kit, and I thought that might look kind of neat if we put it up here on the top. So I'm going to glue this down. 
And then I have the phrase, follow your heart. Since this was a heart stencil from my January club, uh, artistic stencil club, I thought it would look good down here. And you didn't know you can get past months of my artistic stencil club. So when you place an order, just stay in the comment box that, hey, I would like to have the January first uh, or I would like to have August of 2019 as my first kit and I can send that to you all right so there is my page that I have created so now I'm supposed to write about what made me smile today so let me do that and I'll be right back all right, so I'm using the Sharpie No Bleed writing pen. I like using this pen because it doesn't bleed through my page. It's a felt tip pen. I, I don't know. It's just a nice, sharp pen. Today for January the 19th, the creative prompt was to use a stencil and then write about something that made you smile. My dog Hercules always makes me smile. It was very cold this morning and Hercules didn't want to get out of bed. Henry grabbed him and made Hercules go outside. Once Hercules was done, he ran back to bed and got under his blanket. I don't blame him one bit. It was well below freezing. Follow your heart, Hercules, or the heat. LOL. <laughs> well, I hope that inspires you to write in your journal today, to create a journal page as well. And then, of course, take a picture of it and share it inside the Friendly Junk Journal People Facebook group. We'd love to see your take on each prompt. Do come back tomorrow as I'll have January the 20th ready for you to go. All right, everybody. Again, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.